In this tutorial, we are going to do the remaining questions from chapter 3. Now, the C question. Which feature of Excel should be used to do the following? To present data in pictorial form, that is, in the charts. The next one. To compare large sets of data, that is, X, Y or scatter chart. The next. To find the bottom of bottom 10 items of a list, so it is conditional formatting. The next, to get particular information from a list without changing the order of the list, that is filter. To arrange the data of a column in descending order, so to arrange in ascending or descending order, we use the sort option. So filter is used to filter the information, conditional formatting to find the bottom 10 items, then xy chart for large sets of data and pictorial form there is charts. Now next, next is match the column. So filter is separate, auto filter, one criteria, advanced filter, more criteria, the next is sort is arrange. The next, what kind of chart else do the column I can denote. So first one is line, next one is xy scatter, the next one is column, the next one is file. Let's move on to the next question. Which tab should be clicked to do the following? So first one, to print a worksheet, file tab, to change the chart type, design tab, to get the advanced filter option, data tab, to create a chart from a given data, that is insert, then next, to sort a given column, so it is data, then next, to perform conditional formatting on data, it is home. Under which tab are the following options found? Conditional formatting under Home, Charts under Insert, Chart Title under Layout, then Chart Styles under Format. So that's all for today. Thank you. Do this question and answers in your copy and we will, I will take it later on.